Hello, all my dear friends. I'm Oliver from Token Hobby. Here, this big box inside it is a 50 kg 9150 excavator from Lesu back shovel. So let's open to see it. Okay, everything in the box already take out, the parts, the leather, uh, and also the plate. So this I will put ready to run, put additional battery and the EV light radio. So later I will assemble all the parts and set up the radio running it, see you and uh, show you all the details. So put the filter here, we fill up the hydraulic oil and same time you check the oil level here put until high level okay now the level is a little bit high level and running to let the oil go to all the cylinder start the pump running a little bit Oil go to all the oil system, get out the air. Okay, now check again the oil level. Check oil tank. So looks like the level not dropping too much because maybe originally in the cylinder already have oil. So oil level keeping like this is enough. So if sometime when I before send out, I will drain the oil in the tank. System no have oil. So after you running, the oil level will go down. You can increase to fill up a little bit more. So a little more than middle, that's enough. Okay. Put the cap and secure with six screws. So change one air vent plug. This screw, change it. So when running, let the all your tank air vent freely. Okay, put the cap and secure it. That's it. So EV light radio is on. Let's put the battery. Support here. 3S battery, this one 5200 mAh. T shape. So have a, this one, that's a 12B receiver. Double pump is there. So let's start it. Power switch. Inside of the cabin is the handle, push up, power on. Spinning left side, you will see the light, light on. So we see cabin light on the side and also here and on the arm, also right side. This side have the light and uh, Spinning around, you will see re rear side of cabin also have the light. And also rear side this position. Switch it on. Warning light on. Also this one. Changing different mode. Okay, so mix control to start the pump. Mix on. Let's run it. See how it's moving.
So if add the smoking system and sound system, will be wonderful. And let's see the slow moving of it. So already set up mix control. So slow moving the big arm. Speed up. Up position, go up slowly. Increasing, increasing. So you can make a fine control of it. And the front arm, slowly coming down. Speed up. Go up slowly and speed up. That's the fine control. See the bucket? Slowly going in, speed up. Slowly go out, speed up. That's the fine moving of it. See the track, left track, right track, forward, backward, spinning. Turn around, have a general look. And spinning, rotation up part. Now it's running around 50% of the rotation. No, this one big machine, no need rotation too fast. So let's see a little bit of the details. This all metal, this steel one, welding plate, secured by screw, and also this, this is alloy leather. So all, most of the parts, except this leather, they are CNC metal. And here we see, uh, for the teeth, it is copper color. And uh, the bucket, it is also it's welding. So for other parts, it's arm, and uh, the main body is the CNC. Okay, so see the details. Open the cabin. We see inside the screen. It's showing. Screen is showing the voltage now 12.1. Also the oil temperature. This one in the tank, they have the sensor. It's telling the oil temperature. Here, this one can open. We see electronics inside. This door can open. Here, the handle it is inside. Open the door. Inside, we see. So, here we have the pressure gauge, and uh, this one is adjusting the flow and start the pump directly. You can see the pressure growing. It's a little bit, almost a 6 MPa. Close the door. Open the upper part, cover, standing support. So here we see the battery chamber. We put 3S battery and uh, downside this one, that's the pressure release valve, adjusting the system pressure. Receiver put in here. And uh, under there, that's the distribution valve. So for distribution valve means one is not using. For the front shovel, we have one more function for opening the bucket. So now this one not using, only three distribution valve is used. So the oil pump, double pump, and for distribution valve, same as the front shovel one. Here we have the decoration. This one is a extinguisher, exhaust, uh, this is air filter for Inlet, imitating one, and this position we will see the cooler. That's the fan. This side, cooler other side. That's the cooler at this position. Here's the rotation motor, and uh, turn it around. Let's see this side.
opening the door. Here we can see the double pump. And this door open. We see the cooler. Outside is the cooler fan. So for the bucket and the arm, it's all double cylinder. And uh, here that's all the metal pipe fixed. So the junction with the hose. And here's the arm, two cylinder. And also see the metal pipe and the hose. So coming to here, all this arm and the bucket, this oil pipe, metal one, and uh, the hose coming downside. So double cylinder downside, that's for the big arm. So all the holes coming under the plate, under this top plate, go to the distribution valve. And uh, turning a little bit this position, here that's uh, the oil return line to the oil tank. And the suction inside have a filter inside. So suction go to the pump, no parts go inside to damage the pump. So from this angle, you can see the thickness of these metal chassis. And uh, here's the two cylinder for the big arm. I uh, will lift up so you can see downside how is the chassis looks like. Have a good look. Here also this uh, bridge, also these rollers, top rollers. I put it down. So this one. 55 kg is quite heavy. So at this size, 55 kg and uh, all these beautiful details and the finely beautiful and very strong painting. This one, the painting very hard, not easy to have scratch. So in total, this one is the beautiful, most beautiful machine on the, on the world you can find. So later I will make another video to show you how to make the radio settings to make a fine control of this beautiful machine. So see you again, bye.